Welcome to this Lee Daniels Art Quick Tip Tutorial, Gadgets Part 1, HUD Elements and Targets. Start by making a new shape layer, add an ellipse and a stroke, increase the size, increase the width of the stroke, add a dash and alter the size of the dash. Duplicate the layer and alter the size the width of the stroke and the dash and then select one of the layers hit R to bring up the rotation controls and then holding down the ALT key click on the rotation stopwatch and type in wiggle brackets 0.5 comma 200 end brackets this will create a random rotation for the target select the rotation and copy and paste to the other ring and this forms the basis for building your circular elements. By duplicating this process several times, you can make a wide array of random, broken, dashed and dotted ellipses. And by switching size, random rotation amount and adding some static layers, you can quickly create different looks. To make lines and targets, make a new shape layer, add a rectangle and a fill, and then in the rectangle path options, alter the size and offset the position. And then add a repeater. And in the repeater transform options, set the position to zero. And then on the rotation control, hold down the Alt key, click on the stopwatch and type in 360 divided by and then drag to the copies. So now when you alter the amount of copies, it will automatically distribute the shapes. And then all you have to do is alter the size of the original rectangle to create your target. To create some measurement lines, duplicate the layer, increase the amount of copies, adjust the position, and then hit T to bring up the opacity and then reduce to 25. Using the repeater technique, you can easily add dots, lines and markings to increase the detail of your target. And you can easily customise this entire process to create hundreds of different designs. Right, that's the end of this tutorial. Please subscribe to my Lee Daniels Art YouTube channel where you'll find examples of some of my animated shorts, client work and news about upcoming tutorials. Thanks for watching.